It's super early. I don't usually make videos like this, but I have a long day ahead of me, and I'm going to take you all along. Starting route to Richmond. Made it to Richmond in seven hours, pretty much on the dot. Need to be here at 11.45, I'm actually 45 minutes early. In order to make it this far and be 45 minutes early, I'm pretty impressed with myself. The reason that I'm here is to be on the NBC News at noon in Richmond. It was an awesome opportunity and you can't let these opportunities pass you by. Hopped in the car, made this long drive. I'm going to take you inside and then after that I'm going to hit some of my favorite local trails that are right downtown Richmond. I just built up a brand new bike yesterday so I'll give you a quick peek at that and then it's basically back on the road and back to New Jersey another seven hours home. So let's head inside. Hi, how are you? I'm good. You've heard of them referred to as green rooms before, and they actually are green. We're going to take this on the air, talk about some bikes, talk about some new trails being built. And for all of us at home or even here in the studio that are trail enthusiasts, we got a pretty cool event coming up here on Friday at Pocahontas State Park. And Jeff Lenoski is here to tell us all about it. It's great to be here. And you also brought your bike. I brought my bike, so <laughs> at least I have an excuse for wearing a bike outfit in indoors. I love it. Okay, so Friday coming up here at the State Park. What event? Tell us about what's going on. So I've been coming to Richmond for about 10 years, and I've always ridden the James River Park system, but in the past few years, Pocahontas State Park has really been growing into a huge regional ride center. So yeah. I've been talking to the guys at RVA Moore. They just finished eight new miles of single track, and we're going to get to preview it on Friday. Okay, so, so it's a pretty exciting opportunity. Okay, so as we look at some of this video back here, it seems it's very cool video, but as you see here, do you have to be like a beginner or do you have to be like well skilled <laughs> to is participate? Actually right in Richmond, believe it or not. Really? So I have a video series called Trail Boss, and that's where I travel all around the country and I try to find the hardest trails possible. On Friday, it's just a group ride, so you won't be doing stuff like this. That's the good news. <laughs> it's just to get out and have a fun ride with um, the local community. Like I said, I've been coming here for so long, and I usually come for River Rock and different events, but I'm not getting a chance to get out and ride with the local riders, so right. this is my chance. I love that. So now for the local riders who would like to attend here on Friday, talk about what you should wear, as in maybe even some safety tips here. Well, the great thing about Richmond is you have a really, really good trail organization here. It's called RVA Moore. So if somebody's looking to get into mountain biking, it's a great club to join, and you could find riders of your own skill level and get out there and and learn what you need to do to start mountain biking and if you're an experienced mountain biker you can find experienced riders to ride with as well so obviously if you're going mountain biking first thing is a helmet um, padded bike shorts usually yeah. help um, for first timers main thing that you want to do is get a helmet so you could be safe and a pair of bike shorts so you're comfortable that's the, the bare minimum but then as you get into mountain biking there's so much gear that you could can buy and try. All right, so we got 10 more seconds here, but tell everyone at home where should they should meet you guys at the park on set. So Friday. there is an Eventbrite on my social media. It's Facebook, uh, Ride With Jeff, or you can just look up Jeff Lenoski on Instagram. I've been posting all week the information, or check out RVA more. Sounds good, Jeff. Thank you so much for jo joining us here today. That went pretty good. I've been doing TV spots like this a pretty long time, and it's still always kind of funny to me that you go in, and everybody's super nice. And then the second it's over, they're like, peace, see you later, grab a quick photo, and you're on your way back to Jersey. Just the way that that business is. I remember the first time I ever did it, I was sitting there and I did the interview, and then you're like sitting there afterwards, like, call me, I thought we really hit it off. And uh, just the way it goes. <laughs> So here is my new whip. It's a 2018 Giant Anthem 2.9er, DVO Sapphire Fork, Vittoria Reaction SL wheels with some Barzo tires and a full XTR Grupo. 
Shimano Tharsis carbon bars and stem. This is a pretty sweet bike, Topaz rear shock. Stoked to give this thing a ride. Looks like a storm is coming. I better be getting out of here. Seven hours, 30 minutes on the nose. That was a day. Hope you liked this vid. Until next time, I'll see you on the trail. We all here? All right, let's follow Sam. Pretty sweet. Nice, Sam. Little decision maker. Flatlander. That's cool. Nice job, Sam. <laughs> <laughs>